Hey everyone, it's Dr. Z. Quick question and quick answer. Many people have reached out and said, hey, when we had the swine flu, the swine flu, H1N1, people, we, we had a vaccine pretty darn quick. Within months, we had a vaccine that was effective against H1N1 influenza. Why is COVID so different? Why don't we have a vaccine for that? And here's the quick answer. H1N1 is a variant of standard influenza. So we have decades of experience making an influenza vaccine. We know how to manufacture it. All you have to do for H1N1 is change the antigens, the target proteins that you're trying to become immune against with the vaccine. And so we have a whole manufacturing process. We have a quality process and a safety process for that vaccine. So of course you can make it relatively quickly and effectively and safely. With COVID-19, the SARS-2 coronavirus that causes that, we have never made an effective vaccine against coronaviruses in humans. And so as a result, we have to start really from first principles in terms of what we're actually gonna do. And there's so many different ways to make a vaccine. You could have, you could target a purified protein, you could take vaccine and make it inactivated and have the body uh, create antibodies against that. You could use messenger RNA, which is a way to have the, fool the body into making the protein that you want to attack. But then when you do that, then you still have to make sure you have a delivery vehicle that allows the vaccine to enter the body and actually trigger the immune response and things called adjuvants that help increase the immune response so that the vaccine actually works. Then you have to make sure the vaccine doesn't cause more harm than good by enhancing your immune response and accidentally causing a worse reaction when you're exposed to the real virus. Please see the interview I did with Paul Offit about this. So. There's a lot of technical challenges and testing about what's the right dose, how many people should you screen, are there any side effects? You need to do all that from scratch with a coronavirus and that does not happen overnight. And I doubt actually, and so does Paul Offit, that it's gonna happen even within the 18 month parameter. And so that's the simple way to think of, oh, how come we had a swine flu vaccine? Why can't you just give us a corona vaccine? I think that a lot of the lay public doesn't understand that. So hopefully that was helpful. Please share this video, become a supporter, etc. And we out. Stay safe. Peace.